Dad's vlog. <clears throat> Groundhog Day. Somewhere in the late teens of April. Um, still uh, stuck in a hotel right next to the Amazon warehouse. Very possibly could be the only people in this hotel at this time. Um, we have been here for about a month. And we'll probably be here for about another month. As, uh, as our uh, house construction is delayed, courtesy of this virus. So, here we sit, every day, Groundhog Day. But it's a little weird because we are practically the only people in this hotel. As you can see, this floor is closed, as are all the floors above us. And as far as other people staying in this hotel, nope, just us. That's it. As we head down the hallway, this is probably one of the creepiest things um, <laughs> that I've ever walked through. I mean, I get the creeps just walking through. You don't know when somebody's going to jump out. <clears throat> and if my son and David knew that I was doing this, I'm sure they would be prepared to jump out. No doubt. Um, yeah, so... It's been like this for a while now. Pretty quiet. Skeleton crew, skeleton staff. Oh, here's a light. Um, this is the elevator vestibule, which I think I just locked myself into. Which shows us we're on the top of this hotel. What a lovely view of the roof. Eesh. Let's see if I can get back out here. I might be stuck in the twilight zone here. This is this could be scary. I heard a click. Oh, I'm back out. Okay. So here we go. Back down the endless hallway. That's what I see behind me. Nothing. Boy, if this place was haunted, now is the time. I'm telling you. Yeah, so uh, it's, it's, it's a little weird. You know, you have a, you're eating at different restaurants every night. Take out food, you know, wearing a mask. Um, it's a little weird. But anyway, we're getting by this okay. Uh, everybody's keeping busy doing something. Uh, right now the boys are hooked up with their headphones. It sounds like there's like 20 people in the room back there, but it's really only two people playing with a bunch of other people. And they all got their headphones on and some are on the phones and you can hear a bunch of voices, but it's just those two guys, which is kind of weird. Uh, Amazon, this parking lot here is usually filled with trucks. And as you can see, this parking lot here is filled with cars. Uh, and you can see our parking lot here is filled with nothing. Nothing at all. So, we just kind of hang out. You know, it's a weird thing. We're all in limbo. You know, my personal situation is in limbo. The business that I started is definitely not uh, going to be happening anytime soon. This is our laundry room, by the way. We get two washers and two dryers all to ourselves. Of course, school's out. So, David's out, are here, and Eric can't go to Disney. There wasn't a college program there, and that's closed. We can't go visit anybody because there's an order out. So there's a lot of family members we'd love to be with right now, but really can't. It's pretty much everybody's situation. So, uh, this hotel has become our home. It's huge. I call it Winterfell. Because from the outside, it's got that crazy gothic look 